everybody, this is Jeff from my cook Pedro and your mom and today we are having this amazing summer day. Blue skies, people in bikini swimming down outside. So we're gonna have this beautiful tuna fish salad to refresh our asses today. You ready? Let's go. Alright, so let's start guys. We're gonna grab our beautiful spring onions. Add some spring onions right here, they're kinda old, but that's okay. So we're gonna chop up the green parts, like so. I like my tuna fish very oniony, so I would say like around, that should be okay. So now, we're gonna grab the white part. I'm gonna make a little bit of a cross in here. There you go. There you go. Let me show this to the camera real quick. Do you see that? So now that we have our spring onions, we're gonna have our bowl. We're just gonna put everything in. All that beautiful spring onion going in. Time for the tomato. Just gonna chop it up real quick. So this is already looking beautiful. We're gonna grab our beautiful lime. Let me show it to the camera real quick. And then we're just gonna have that in. Again, this is just a quarter of a line because I we don't want it to be super strong, alright? This is just to give a little bit of a hum. I like a lot of pickles in my stuff, so we're gonna add three large pickles. We're gonna chop them like this, like cross, and then chop the living shit out of them. Alright, ready? Time for speed video. Go! Phase number two, do you like my speed video? <laughs> Let's try again. First like this, then like this. Ninja skills. So, one fell in the floor, that's okay. No big deal, don't cry. Let's put our beautiful pickles in there. This is very fussy guys, seriously, if you don't feel like make this, you are just so bloody lazy, I swear to god. And this is so good, so so good. Alright, so now that we've got everything in, let's get our beautiful tuna fish. Alright, so now I'm back. I drank this little uh, tuna fish can because, to be honest, I don't like it when it's very watery and i think you should try to make it as dry as possible otherwise you're not gonna get that beautiful consistency we're gonna have our there we go i would say around like three four tablespoons of mayo which is quite a bit like if you think about it it's quite a lot but yeah, some friends of mine actually put way more like half a fucking bottle into that. And we want to keep it fairly, shit, fairly healthy. I'm kind of blown away how good this is and how simple. This is still the consistency we're going for. That's great, and let me do a try now. Let's see. Mm. Fuck it. That's amazing. That's a wrap right there. So all we need right now is some amazing bread. The best type of bread you can find. And that's how you eat it. Let me show you right now. So thank you very much you guys for watching this recipe. If you like that, give me a big thumbs up, always subscribe, and if you've got any questions, post them in the comment section down below. This was Jeffrey, I cook better and your mom, and I'll see you next time.